You've heard all about it. If you didn't see it at 6 o'clock tonight, well, we're going to give you another chance tonight at 10. Color Scan 500, exclusively on Television 5. You may not be aware of it, but the last week here at Channel 5, a lot of people have been working very hard to make sure you know more about the weather. For instance, Bob Harris here working on this little gadget I've got in my hand. Then down in our carpentry shop, Paul Taylor putting together a new set so that we can bring you what I'm about to show you in just a second. Also, out at our transmitter site where we have our ray dome and the radar installation, well, we had quite a bit of uh, equipment to go in out there. Herb Gilbert, you see him there putting it in out there. Now, what this is all about is the Color Scan 500. I'm sure you've heard that mentioned already tonight. And in Nashville, radar has looked much like this for the past 19 years. Since 1958, we've had radar here on Channel 5. But take a good long look because you're not going to see that kind of radar on Channel 5 anymore. I'll show you what I mean. Come on over this way and take a look at the brand new Color Scan 500 radar system. In fact, here's what it looks like, and uh, we've got a little bit of a problem. A little bit of a problem. I'll tell you what, we'll come back to the Color Scan 500 in just a little bit. I want to show you what we looked like today in Nashville. We had a really s strange day in Nashville. In fact, we're going to try this one more time. There's the Color Scan 500, and as we start uh, with, what have, what have we done here? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me push this button. That button doesn't do anything. That button. Ah, well, somebody started out there. I think my buttons are mixed up, I'll tell you. Let's see, let me push this button, see what happens. All right, one more time. Our buttons evidently aren't gonna, let me show you what's gonna happen when we get my buttons, when we get me straightened out. We're gonna show you rain in different colors, and the different intensities will look like this. Not like that, but like this. Take a look at this. No, we're not going to take a look at that either. Well, it worked at 6. It really did, folks. If you saw it at 6, it was, it was all right. We're going to go back to Chris and Dave, and I'm going to slowly slink out of here in the West. He throws it back to us, huh? <laughs> he says, you guys save him, right? Is that what he's saying? It's your turn, Dave. Oh, it's my turn. It's your turn. Dave. You're sure. <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> the radar is going to show different colors with severity of storms is what it all boils down to. The, it'll be electronically pick it up and the color coding it from light colors to sprinkles, sprizzles, to dark colors like red for serious storms coming our way. And we're just lucky there are no clouds out there tonight to see anyway, but we did want to give you the demonstration of the thing. And as soon as Mark figures out which button to push, <laughs> it, it, it works and it works it great. Is, it's too. great, it really is, because yeah. at six it was super, it really was. Okay, now we'll be back tomorrow of the thing and as soon as mark figures out which button to push it, <laughs> we'll it, it. works and it works it is great it's too. great it really is because yeah. at six it was super it really was okay now we'll be back tomorrow night at six and ten have a pleasant evening everybody <laughs> <laughs>